happening tonight as a Bakersfield College staff member now part of that sexual assault investigation after a student came to them for reporting help after Robinson was acting suspicious near that women's restroom. Tonight 23 ABC's Andrew Worth joins us now live with how time could have possibly saved this victim. Andrew. Yes, Tim and Jackie, you're taught here at BC, if you see something, say something. Now that awareness last week probably helped to find the alleged serial rapist. Though one staff member who was approached by a student, now part of this investigation for not speaking up. New details coming to light today following last week's sexual assault on the campus of Bakersfield College. Today, Christopher Counts, the Bakersfield College Director of Public Safety, said an instructor is now part of the active investigation for not reporting a student's concerns. Counts says that student approached the instructor about seeing a suspicious man near the women's restroom, but the instructor allegedly did not help. Lewis Gill, the CEO of Alliance Against Family Violence and Sexual Assault, says timing in a situation like this is critical. It's important that if somebody reports something to you, take action because a lack of action can cause harm. In this situation, Gill says the student did their part by saying something to a person with more authority. Counts confirmed with 23ABC that the student who had seen the suspect, Brandon Robinson, near the women's restroom, immediately went for help. After the instructor supposedly did not help, the student then found another instructor who took action by calling police. Gill again saying this student made all the right decisions. The worst thing that's going to happen is there's a misunderstanding. That's the absolute worst thing, right? But you might save bunny, somebody from great harm. Through his work with sexual assault victims, Gill says never hesitate to speak up, especially if something seems wrong. Crimes of this sort cause great damage, and we need to make sure that when people ask for help, that we provide help. Not taking action can result in someone being harmed. Quickly responding when you're told something could prevent further harm. Now, Counts today could not say what happens next for that instructor here at Bakersfield College, but as for Robinson, he is still facing 13 felony charges for those three separate sexual assaults. Live here tonight at Bakersfield College, Andrew Worth, 23 ABC. Andrew